Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 3705 as a special dedication to Malachi. Now this is a hard level, I can tell by the purple stripes and the skull here. We've got 25 moves to clear out 57 jelly and collect 14 ingredients. So the ingredients are all in these candy cane fences, which isn't good. We can drop them here or here, and it looks like we've got a portal system that's just going to keep bringing them from box to box, but we've got to clear out all of this junk, and that's tough to do. I have a very limited field here. It's a hard level, so I don't expect to be able to get it done right away, but let's just see what we can do on this board. Now, hitting this is going to go right to this licorice, and then it's going to get stopped. It's not going to go any further. I wish I could slide this over a bit. I'm going to hold off and see if I might be able to do that. Uh, nope. This is the only move I have, so let's go ahead and take it and keep going from here. It's better if I can make direct connections against these licorice. I'll try to show you what I mean if I ever get any moves that allow me to do it. Can't get a color bomb there. Wow, just waiting for my reshuffle at this point. wishing I could get a reshuffle. Okay, so we're punching through here, and now see I'm taking out that licorice just by tapping next to it, and that's really helpful. I could do this and it would draw things through. I don't know how helpful it would be. Let's do this to open more stuff up. Okay, I'm going to try this, getting rid of some of that orange. That's not helping. So let's go ahead and take out a color, because it was unlikely I was going to be able to pair that up with a special. So that at least clears things out for me, concentrates things down. But yeah, this is kind of awful. Haven't gotten very far at all. So sorry, Malachi. If you just want to see me beat the level, advance to the last probably three or four minutes. Otherwise, it's going to take me a while to establish a strategy and then to combine that strategy with enough luck on the board. But first I need live, so I will pause the recording and meet you back here in just a bit. Okay, so this looks like a really good starting board. And I'm enjoying getting through here right away. Oh my goodness. So this is the kind of thing we need to have happen. And I know that it's important. Sometimes it's hard to get there, but this board is being very, very helpful to me. And I now need to try to continue that. What's the best course of action? Should I take out the blue up here, hoping it'll get more purple? Should I take this blue out down here? Should I make a different choice? I'm going to take this blue because it's lowest to the ground, and so it has the potential to create that cascading opportunity that we look for. This can take out a barrier. Okay, now I'm putting the green together here. Going to bust through that shelf. Okay, wrapped, wrapped combo. I can do a striped wrapped or a wrapped wrapped. I think at this point in time the wrapped wrapped is going to be good because it's going to take out a lot of this licorice. The wrapped wrapped gets through the licorice much better than the striped wrapped does. There go all the ingredients. Okay, so now I've got this opportunity. I love it. But I still have licorice, and we know that stripes don't go well through licorice. So before I set this off, I'm taking out licorice, knowing that anything could set this off, that I could lose it. But I think that was a really good choice, because look at this. We've got three, one jelly left. Now the problem is, even though I've got 11 turns, it's in the corner and it's double thick. We are not done. So I've got an opportunity to make a stripe. Can I extend it and make a color bomb? by getting a purple here. I don't see how. I could move this orange over, but the orange doesn't connect. I could try to blow things up. I'm going to go ahead and do this. Now I've got this striped wrapped together. Is there any way to slide it down lower? Move it over a bit so it reaches here. Again, I don't quite see it, so it didn't matter to me that that blew up. Okay. So now we've got a few things going here. I can make a stripe, but it's not aimed here. Or I can do this and stack up the purple. I'm going to stack up the purple. Try to bring it through. Not quite yet. There we go. So now I got that gone. 
This is not looking good. If I take this, oh, here we go. If I take this blue, this purple stacks, and I do this. It took so many turns for me to get here. I didn't have that extraordinary luck that I had seen earlier with the color bomb stripe. But remember, you're going to need a combination of luck and skill to get this done. This was not just my second playthrough. This was my 22nd playthrough. So Malachi, I can see why you're frustrated. The good news is, once I developed a strategy, I got close on probably 80 or 90% of the games that I played. And that strategy is, go for the center if you can. Really break through that... Uh, the licorice down below if you can. Use wrapped candies as often as you can. Look to make combos by making cascades. Opening that space up will allow you to make those cascades. And then when you do get good opportunities, don't waste them. Really look at the board and invest in the opportunities by making the best choices possible. So I hope this helps. If it does, I'd ask that you folks consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching.